in this problem we are given a rectangle and there is a triangle inside that and that triangle area is shaded in blue we have to find what fraction of this complete area of rectangle is occupied by this blue region the shaded region and the condition here given is that this is a rectangle so this these all angles are 90 degree and opposite sides are equal and an additional condition is that all three angles are equal this angle this angle and this angle all three are equal so you have to find what is the area of this blue region divided by area of this complete rectangle this triangle denotes area so pause the video solve it yourself and then come back when we you have the solution or you are stuck now let's solve this problem so we are given these three angles are equal and we know that all the angles of a rectangle are 90 degree so if we divide 90 into three parts we get 30 so this angle is 30 degree this is 30 degree and this is also 30 degree now let's assume this is the height this length is h and this is the width let's call it w so what will be the area of rectangle it will be h times w now let's come to this part the white region white triangle on the top so if this is 30 this is 90 this has to be 60 the sum of all three angles is 180 in a triangle so if this is 60 and this is h these opposite sides are same so uh, we know that uh, what is if you look in this triangle what is tan 60 degree tan theta is height divided by width so here tan 60 is equal to this length w divided by height and tan 60 is root 3 so we know that w is same as h root 3 and root 3 is 1.732 so this is obviously more than this height so now we have just one variable here h h is there and this w can be represented in terms of h so this area will be uh, half of the complete area you can see this this in this triangle what is the area a is let's call it a1 it's half times this length times this length that is wh and w is h so h root 3 times this h which is h square now let's find uh, this area so this is again 60 degree so if this is uh, h then what will be this length this length will be again we will say tan 60 equal to h divided by this length let's call it x so x becomes h divided by tan 60 is root 3 so this length is h divided by root 3 and what will be this length this length will be this complete length is h root 3 so this will be h root 3 minus this length x x is h divided by root 3 so this would be h root 3 so what is this length this is 3h you take the common root 3 as the LCM so this multiplied by root 3 becomes 3h minus h 2h so this length is 2h and this height is h so what is the area this area a2 is half times base base is 2h divided by root 3 times height this is height h so this 2 gets cancelled so a2 is h square divided by root 3 and we have to find a2 divided by complete area what will be complete area complete area will be h times w or w is h, h root 3 so h square root 3 we even did not need that let's delete it so we just need this area so this is what we need to find and we have h, a2 is h square divided by root 3 and then in denominator we have h square root 3 this h square h square cancels 
we are left with 1 by root 3 times root 3 and what is 1 root 3 times root 3 it's 3 so 1 by 3 so this blue shaded region uh, divided by rectangle complete rectangle area is 1 is to 3 ratio or one third of the area is covered in this shaded region so i hope you enjoyed this problem it was a simple application of trigonometry stay tuned for uh, more problems like this and uh, don't forget to subscribe the channel if you don't want to miss out on new videos like this